Evening, maybe a good evening for some ice cream. Temperatures are in the 70s. It's a nice, a mild evening. Sunshine in a few spots, still dealing with clouds and others. Uh, but the good news Doppler radar not picking up on a whole lot of rainfall, although there are a few isolated sprinkles possible here. One little blip here in parts of uh, Portage County, and I'm tracking a few more of those off to our west and southwest tonight. But as the sun sets, this risk will decrease for us. Uh, and overnight, only a small chance. I mean, a very small chance, a 20% chance of an isolated shower or sprinkle. Uh, the biggest part of the night stays dry, but here's the problem. Big storm system that's spinning way off to our north. It just keeps flinging these little disturbances around it, and each time one of these come through, we're going to see uh, the chance of showers and storms igniting again across the area. The next best chance would be tomorrow afternoon as that next wave rolls around this big area of low pressure. So here's the way it shapes up through the evening. The biggest part of the evening stays dry, isolated shower or sprinkle. And if you get one of these, they will be quick movers and slide right on out. But overall, expecting mostly dry weather uh, through the night into tomorrow morning. Small chance for an isolated shower again tomorrow morning. Temperatures pushing into the low 50s. Now, uh, through the day tomorrow, big part of the day is going to try to stay dry. As we go through the morning, that isolated shower threat midday, uh, still mainly dry. Temperatures pushing into the lower 70s. It's tomorrow afternoon when the risk of some showers and thunderstorms as that next disturbance moves through here, fire back up. And I am expecting a line of these to develop here uh, pretty much right over top of us and then sweep eastward. And if they can get going uh, early enough and in that heat, there's a small chance for some gusty wind and some heavy rainfall with those as they push on through. They should be out of here on into tomorrow evening, and that is going to open the door for some good weather here on into Thursday morning. Skies clearing out. That means a lot of sunshine early Thursday uh, into Thursday afternoon. Nice sunshine expected. Just a few clouds building and temperatures heading into the upper 60s close to 70. So a little better news in the forecast tonight. Isolated shower mainly early and a very small chance at that tomorrow temperatures in the upper 60s partly sunny skies not wet all day long but the best chance of a shower or thunderstorm into the afternoon by tomorrow evening now that threat will be moving out of here and that's good news for Thursday lots of sunshine especially early low 70s Friday mid 70s and uh, temperature is going to stay mild into the weekend, but June uh, kind of getting off to a rocky start there. The risk of showers and thunderstorms around as we go into Friday on into Saturday. The best chance Saturday would be later in the day. Unfortunately, that risk is going to stick into Sunday with a small chance of a shower next Monday and Tuesday. And cooler temperatures yeah. trying to slide in, but the cooler temperatures are ahead of the high pressure system I've been talking about. It's just holding up a few more days, but it looks like it still will move in on into the middle of next week. So what you're saying is it's looking into next week like it's going to be warm and dry? Well, drier, not I wouldn't say warm, okay. but better weather and not these big bursts of rainfall after we get through the early part of the week. All right. All right.